morning guys, we're leaving for a while. Um, we're gonna be babysitting Leland and Lyra today at our house, which is about 20, 20, about 25 miles, give or take, from here. So uh, this is the woods. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that either. Like I said, I'm still getting used to this phone. No! There we go. That's what we're backed up to in the motorhome. Anyway, still lots of snow and it's very sparkly today. Sparkly, sparkly. Dogs are with us, of course. We're in the suburban, which is usually full of stuff. And, uh, that's it. So I will see you back at our house. It's about, I don't know what time, because his clock says 8.10. I know that's not right. I think it's a little before 9. But anyway, I'll see you back at the house. Bye. Just thought I'd show you the lake. It's open, open water on the east end of the lake in the bay. I did see a little bit of ice on top, but certainly not enough to support any weight. You know. Yep, we're back in Houghton Lake. There's a library, the elementary, the middle school, then the elementary school. High school is behind and behind the library, sort of. Let's see what's on at the pines. Batman versus Superman. Since Rocky saw it and said that it was not a good movie at all, we won't go see it. Hey, there's a water. We didn't get to watch the ice break up this year like we have in previous years. There are kids here. Hi, Lyra Jade. Jeez, what a good girl. She's been working on getting these out. Leland's. Yeah, it's amazing how fast these tables pile up. <laughs> no bird cages on them. Um, do you like that wreath? You know what? I love that wreath. And you know where it's going to go? Where? It's going to go out there in the middle of the wall, right where everybody can see it. Because I'm going to paint that room and it's going to go out there. Yeah, you got a squeaky toy? You got dog toys. <laughs> and a cat toy. Leland set up his fire truck. He was about to... Where's Lyra? Where'd Lyra go? Lyra Jade! Where's that baby girl? She hiding. Leland got this for Christmas when he was about two and a half. No, I'm six and a half. Now you're almost seven. You're going to be seven next week. Not next week. Week. Next week means the week after this next one. So less than two weeks, you're going to be seven. Yep. I'm going in. No, you can sleep. What's your birthday? April 7th. That's right. I was born in 2009, April 7th. That's right. So you'll be seven. <laughs> yes, go in there. Go in there. I'm tired. Who came out? <laughs> I'm tired. Weird here with no bird cages. Hey, 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 hey. Oh no! <laughs> she loves that. Yeah, I'm going down. Yeah, he fell down, huh?
Now I play one handed because I'm recording for my vlog. You're gonna play the bells? I. You're gonna play the bells? Shake be those playing. bells! Shake those bells! Oh yeah, Bobo has a good girl! There you go! Good girl! Hey, what's this? Yep, that's right. He likes you, Leland. Yeah. He's learning that children are nice. Yeah. Thank you so much for helping me with that, Leland. You're welcome. Because he's never been around kids. Yeah, he doesn't. He, they said that he doesn't like kids. They said either he hasn't been around them or else he's been around kids that were mean to him, so he doesn't like kids. So he didn't trust them, but... You've been very patient with him today, haven't you? I've let him, I've let him smell me. Yeah. Lick me somehow. Yep. And let him do anything to me. Yep, and he learned that you're not going to hurt him. So that's why he's letting me rub him on the belly. Right. He likes you to rub him on the belly. Mm-hmm. You've been a big help training him to like children. You've been a big helper today. And babies. And babies, yeah. Now he knows that babies and kids are nice. That's right. Even well, adults. Yeah. Nobody, where nobody's going to hurt him. Heart. Do you? You love him now? Yeah. You still love Curly Bass, though, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Grab my, grab my thumb. Yep, grab it, just like that. Are you ready? No pretties. Okay, coming through the, the other end of Prudenville and on our way back to the motorhome, we had a great day with the kids today, and um, we had a blast. Pete and Lyra got a nap together, and Pete was just saying that he's covered in Lyra spit. <laughs> spit and snot. Yeah, and there is uh, the East Bay of Houghton Lake. It's pretty well open right now. Earlier it looked like there was a little thin sheet of ice, but right now it looks like it's still pretty open. So my main thing tonight is I've got to practice for tomorrow morning. My back is still hor horrible. I can barely walk and I can't walk upright. So day four. Um, so I'm going to get to the church and practice as much as I possibly can and that is my whole goal for the night because tomorrow's Easter so there will be lots of people there and you know I don't want to play stupid 
Hi guys, it's quarter to 11. Spent a couple hours up at the church practicing for tomorrow's service. It was a beautiful day. It was in the 40s and it was sunny. We still have quite a bit of snow though. Which leaves me with a dilemma because my pants that I'm wearing tomorrow for Easter are capris and I can't wear shoes and socks or boots with them. I could wear my sandals. Sandals and snow is not a big deal to me except for the fact that I will have to walk actually through the snow. So that does leave me with a dilemma. I'll let you know how it turns out. I'll let you know what I decide. We had a great time with Leland and Lyra. They're super fun kids. Leland is just so darling and so sweet. He and Casey lived with us until he was about two and a half or a little over. over. And then Casey got an apartment, but she was working two jobs. And so he was still with us most of the time because when she was working, he was with us. So he, it was about, he was, it wasn't until he was about four and a half that they moved down to Midland, which is 75-ish, 75 to 80 miles from us. So he was a huge major part of our lives for all that time. He's turning seven on the seventh. We really have a soft spot for him. He's just such a huge part of our lives for so very long. Just being able to spend time with him today is, I just really, that's special to me. I really appreciate that. There's a clip of Bill in there too. I didn't ask him if he wanted to be on the vlog, but he didn't object. Because I talked to Casey about it right in front of him and said, do you think Bill will mind being on the vlog? And she goes, probably not. So good enough for me. So that is it. I'm going to go get this done and get it uploaded. Obviously I didn't have time to watch any vlogs today even though we had the internet at our house but it was a very busy day. So and tomorrow will be a very busy day. It's always busy when we move. I will see you guys tomorrow. I hope you guys all are having a great weekend and I hope you have the happiest of happy Easter's and um uh, as always, don't forget to pray for your pastors and enjoy your um, Resurrection Day service if you, uh, you know, if you go. And if not, have a great day anyway. So I will see you tomorrow. Take care. God bless and good night.